Hi, hello. Now we are going to solve problem 4.9 from Sadiku Bob. And this is the question. So you can see in the screen. So we have this circuit here. This circuit. Uh, voltage source, a current source, and two resistor. Uh, and we have this circuit. And then, given that when I, given that I is 4 ampere, when Vs is 40 volt, and Is is 4 ampere. And then in the second condition, when Vs is 20 volt and Is is 0 ampere, I is 1 ampere. So we need to use superposition and linearity to find out the value of I when Vs is equal to 60 volt and Is is equal to minus 2 amps. Okay, first we need to notice here that this is zero ampere and a current source with a value of zero ampere is equal to an open circuit so let's just erase that so this is equal to open circuit so i will erase this and we will have a simple circuit with only one voltage source and two resistor now we have 20 volt here and the current that going through here is 1 ampere so according to linearity we can multiply this 20 volt and we will get the value of i which is 2 ampere so let's just copy this circuit and change the value okay i have the circuit now let's let's mark this as linearity okay okay we can multiply this vs by 2 which is equal to 44 but that means we have to multiply this current also by 2 so we will have 2 ampere here okay now, now we can break down this circuit into superposition by using superposition. So we break into two circuit with each source turn off. So we'll have two circuit. Okay, let's redraw that. So I will need to copy this. Okay, this is our circuit for circuit. And we need to turn off this current source, so I will erase that. And this value become a node. Okay, and then we also have another circuit in the superposition which the voltage source is turned off okay so i will have this voltage source turned off and remember that voltage source turn off is replaced by a short circuit so like this sorry about that let's just make straight line then it's hard to make straight line okay and this value also become unknown Okay, so we have break down this circuit here into this two circuit by using superposition. Okay, now let's see what we get here. Remember that we do not change the resistor value and this is 40 volt. And hey, look at this. This is also 44, so we can conclude that this I will be also 2 ampere. So I will have this I is equal to 2 ampere. And how about this I? So let's just name this I prime. Okay, how about this I? This I double prime. 
Okay, let's see what we get. Because remember that I prime plus I double prime will be equal to the actual current here, which is 4 ampere. So I will have this I prime is equal to 2 ampere. So I will have I double prime is equal to 4 ampere. So I will have I double prime will equal to 2 ampere. So I will have the value of I double prime here is 2 ampere. Okay, now we get this value, this, this circuit, this circuit, and this circuit. Okay, now let's break down this circuit into two similar to this, that one. Okay, now let's do superposition again. Superposition. Okay, let me copy the circuit here. And then another. Oh, it's not that circuit. Okay, let me let me copy the circuit. Okay. Good. Okay, I will have Y. Why? Why? Why we cannot copy this? Oh, I think we can. Yeah. Then. But I think my control button does not work. Okay. Okay, and remember that in superposition we replace the source, the current source by open circuit. So I will erase this. And we replace the Voltage source by short circuit. Okay, so now I have that. And for this one, for this 60 volt, remember that we have this Vs is 20 volt and that is 1 ampere. If we multiply this by 3, this also need to be multiplied by 3 and when this is 60 volt the current here is 3 ampere and this is the same circuit so I will have this I is equal to 3 ampere okay let's name that I prime and here what we have here the value of IS is minus 2 minus 2 Okay, what can we get here? Okay, this circuit similar to this one. So if we if we reverse the sign of the current source, so we will have minus 4a. We will have to change this into minus 2 ampere. But we need to find minus 2. So I will need to divide this by 2. So when we divide this by 2, I will have minus 2 ampere. And the current here must be minus 2 divided by 2, which is minus 1 ampere. So I will have this current value here will be minus 1 ampere. So in this circuit here, I will have the I is equal to I prime plus I double prime from this circuit. This is double prime. So I double prime. So I prime is 3 ampere. And 
then i double prime is minus 1 ampere so i will have i will equal to 2 ampere so hopefully i did not make any mistakes in the calculation do not forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel thank you